Well, did your stepmother enjoy the weekend at Shelbourne? Oh, yes, yes, I think so very much. Weren't you there? Oh, no. The Queen is dead. Long live the Queen. I don't think that's very funny. No, do I. Do you know where she's going this evening? My stepmother, no. She's going to dinner with Guy's mother. I wonder if your father knows. Well, I should imagine so. Huh? But I wonder if he really knows. I nearly got invited there just before I came here to lunch. I knew what it meant immediately. It meant that after years of fending off every woman in sight, like a demented old ocean going tug, she had suddenly said, Guy, you must get married. It would be good for your career. And besides, dear, you need someone to look after you when I'm gone. Hmm. Hardly about that, but didn't you? No, because she's married already. There is such a thing as divorce. So, Polly, do sit down and stop talking such rubbish. I'm sorry if your friendship with Guy Painter has been broken off, but there's, there's no need to... Do you know why I did? I cared too much. Oh, not for Guy. I don't like charm and ruthlessness in a man. One or the other, but both together. There's something nasty about it. Like a female impersonator. Oh, like that. For all that money. So beastly being poor. Harry left a mass of debts. All I have is my widow's pension. The pittance that his parents give me. And then along comes Guy. Suddenly, beautiful flat. Lovely clothes. Just to mention something. Have it. To say, I'd like to go to New or wouldn't it be pleasant to cruise on a yacht in the Mediterranean? It happens. It's irresistible. I'm sure Lady Bellamy will find it so. Oh, there's a weekend. Is that up here?